We're standing on Forsyth Street in downtown Beaumont, Texas. Forsyth Street was one of the center points of the violence during the race riot of 1943. This was the World War II home front town where there was much business activity uh, being produced for goods for, for the World War II effort. The home front industries created these new jobs and they also created uh, new tensions that in some cases resulted in race riots. And there were race riots in Detroit and in Harlem and I think Mobile and in Beaumont, Texas. In, in, uh, in June of 1943, there was this very sad, tragic episode in Beaumont. A race riot broke out here June the 15th, 1943. Uh, there was a story of, about uh, a black man having raped a white woman, and when this story spread into the shipyard, several thousand of the shipyard workers, some say at least 2,000, shipyard workers uh, came out of the shipyard and came downtown to the city hall and to the police department and to uh, try to find the, the person who had allegedly committed this crime. And they found no one and then from there uh, they broke up into groups and they roamed through black, black parts of the town including Forsyth Street where we're standing here. Forsyth was a very uh, uh, vibrant bi black business community with um, lawyers and doctors and pharmacists, insurance agents, retail stores. Uh, there was a movie theater here. Uh, so it was a, a vibrant black business community. And some of these uh, uh, men in the mob attacked this neighborhood. They attacked some of the people. They had tore up some of the automobiles. And they attacked some of the businesses. There were uh, three lives lost, uh, two black people and one white person. So there were three deaths and the Beaumont Police Department uh, energized itself quickly. Uh, they, uh, the National Guard was mobilized and uh, Texas Rangers came to town also. So the, the worst of the violence was over within 24 hours and the town was put under martial law and, um, and, and so it was a brief ugly episode in a time for the town when it was doing very well and when many people had new jobs and, and there was new money and new prosperity. So uh, it was a tragic uh, thing for Beaumont uh, in a time of, of growth and development.